So what is up guys, we are here with some more Watch Dogs Legion, head to the Tower of London to scout it out. And oh, just like that, we are we are here, so now we can see about infiltrating the place. Uh, I recruited another Albion guy just to kind of make it easier for us when we go on in. So let's, let's hope I don't die with this guy. Uh... He's not as cool as the other guy. I think the uh, I think the other Albion guy had had a silencer on the on the pistol. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this guy doesn't. Uh, his skills are are okay. He's just like another like regular, uh, another regular guy basically. Yep, I got my Albion uniform. That was my best bet, guys. Kinda had no clue what else to do there. Oh, sweet. We got the takedown. Doing kind of a bad job at this. Friday, mate. Simmons. Do you know him? Anyway, no matter. He's the one who organized our team building activity. He's rounded up a few of the prisoners they brought in a little while ago. The ones who didn't have any relatives. He figures it'll make for an easier time when we declare them missing. Right. So the fun part. Listen here. I'm gonna tell you something. And it's between you and me. Completely off the record, yeah? The whole thing's quite disturbing to me. They've got good reason to close off parts of the building, but at the end of the day, it's a lot of bollocks. This place is a treasured part of London's history, of its culture. Great, powerful men of... Ooh, made it inside. <laughs> okay. Took a little bit longer than expected. It wasn't the route we wanted to take, but... A word of caution, now we're inside. Any disturbance in here and Nigel Cass will surely cancel his meeting. Avoid being detected by your former colleagues or this operation is a bust.
Talk about empowering my abilities. That's wicked. As he likes to say, there's nothing more valuable than our people's history. Of course, we're seeing plans myself. The museum will be reopening once we're confident. Trying to see what the path of this guy is. Top dollar to upgrade the museum as part of that security, as well as some general improvements. Example, Okay. Where did he actually walk to? Oh, that was my chance. Okay, guys, now I'm here. Trespassers. You're right, I don't. some time for the forgery to be ready. To keep you occupied, I dragged up still images and a recording from an internal investigation into Cassini's death. Show me. Internal psych assessment AS001 subject Cass Nigel. Mr. Cass experienced a deeply traumatic event when he witnessed the murder of his father, Gareth Cass, CEO of Albion. He began exhibiting symptoms soon after what he frequently described as the random event. Mr. Cass's initial symptoms included insomnia, I mean, not leave just in case, blame, and recurring flashbacks. However, he appears to have channeled his anger and self described powerlessness into his work to ensure that Albion become, quote, a mechanism for preventing unpredictable violence. It seems somewhat of a mania edging on psychosis. For me, this raises concerns about Mr. Cass's fitness to run a multinational security company, but I cannot, at this time, make any recommendation beyond continued monitoring, especially considering that I have been asked to close this file. Fuck me. Almost makes you pity him. Oh, wait. No, it doesn't. He's a dickhead. Can't believe that's who's supposed to be secure in London. Yeah, well, Nigel's never close to anyone but his dad. And me, I guess. Never had much faith in people, really. Well, the pass is ready, but rough. If this resistance thing doesn't work out, I doubt you'll make a living as a document forger. Let's give it a go anyway. Nigel Cass awaits. Okay, yeah, I could have just waited over there. Dang it. Hi, 
How are you getting on with those metrics? The deadline is coming up quickly. Yeah, walk away, sir. He's presenting some stakeholders to our don't even joke about it. I don't even want to think about what direction to cast it. Just, just make sure. That guy almost saw me. <laughs> Project Themis. Our new autonomous drones. These drones can identify, isolate, and terminate threats before they can do harm. They can go anywhere. See everything. They could kill a man alone in an alley or in a crowd of hundreds with perfect precision. Themis drones can do what humans have always struggled to. Act immediately and decisively. Oh, dang. That's crazy. Without your support, I couldn't stand here and tell you. I promise you, with the launch of Project Temis, London will be the first city in the world to be made truly safe. Mr. Cass, I was hoping you called us all in here today to discuss the ethical issues. <laughs> No, it's all right. The commissioner cares, as we all do. I admire his, his passion and his dedication. Let's talk ethics. Well, for one, Themis goes far beyond Albion's mandate. We really should have more government consultation. I see. Delay the launch so that we can debate and assess the details. We're missing the human element here. I can get the defense minister on the line right now. If you feel you must. <gasps> Saw that coming. It's the human element that got us into this. No more debate, delay, indecision. Understand this. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. So you gonna kill everybody in the room? Will our friends at Tidus be ready? You are the cornerstone of the project after all. Do you need to consult any outside parties? Uh, no, no. Uh, <laughs> no, we'll be ready. And just in time. Criminals running our streets. Illegals threatening our families. The police commissioner himself. Assassinated by terrorists. Decisiveness is hard, but here's the best part. Once this decision is made, no more will be required of you. A building wide security sweep has been initiated due to Dockham Bridge. How do I escape through the catacombs? Your uniform will help. Don't let them get a close look at you. Bagley, need an exit protocol. The catacombs, fam. Where do I find the cat? Is there like a secret path I can take? Nope. Okay. Who knows when I'll be in here again, so let me pick that up. <laughs> I've been unable to reach the commissioner's office. He's stalling. Doesn't matter. It won't change anything. I won't allow it to change anything. Damn him. Yet another fool who knows what the right thing to do is, but lets emotions get in the way. He's still scheduled to attend. Would you like him removed? No. Despite all, we need to work with the official government to send a security detail to make sure he attends. Dress it like a state privilege and sit him front and center at the meeting. He'll be key to my getting the others to fall into line. Hmm. 
That's totally uncalled for. Oh, don't see me. And you're welcome for not killing you. Oh, I can use my spider bot now. But I don't think I need to now that I can go here. Okay, sweet. <laughs> Sounds like he plans to launch them as ASAP. From the way he was talking, I don't think it's the sort of genie that goes back in the bottle. Not sure if we're going like the right way in here. What the fuck? I'm confused on. What, what all this is down here? Is it safe to go down there? What the fuck was that? This is crazy. Are they draining it or filling it up? Or don't tell me we gotta swim through this. Oh, that's nasty. Sorry it had to happen to you, man. Fucking hell. Albion's top secret project is an automated killing machine. And it looks like Cass is almost ready to launch. We have to get Themis out of his hands. I'll prepare a briefing. Will we see you there, Hamish? Pretty face, not risking, remember? But patch me in. You and me got some scheming to do, that was a fail. All right, so we got a new mass, ETO, and tech points. Yeah, we got 50 of them now, actually. All right, so now we can uh, attend a, a team briefing real quick. So let us do that. Sounds good, my guy. I am on my way. Here's what we know about Nigel Cass. He's rolling out something called Project Themis. The lack of information on its own is worrisome. But what little we do know is Cass which is to remove the human element from law enforcement. We also know he's partnered with Titus, which is never good. Titus does other work with Albion. Nasty shit like autonomous weapons, human targeting algorithms. So Titus is our best lead to fill in the blanks on the secret project, but their security is notoriously difficult to crack. So Hamish has proposed an intriguing solution. Albion's been working on a new micro drone, something my contact told me about. 
That shit's not even in production yet, but if we get the plans, we can manufacture our own. To bypass Titus security? Exactly, exactly. They're weird as fuck. Supposed to do maintenance on Albion's other drones, but the smallness of them means they can slip into places nothing else can. Well, there we have it. Our next step is to infiltrate the Albion drone manufacturing lab and get our hands on schematics. And then you lot will have a fun little gadget to break in the Titus. Love it. I'll shoot you the location. Be careful. Albion doesn't like to share his toys. Alrighty. Oh man, so now we gotta steal some microdone schematics. Okay, that's fine with me. But guys, I'm gonna do that next episode. So I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps with the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. It helps with the channel a lot. And with that said, stay sharp. Later.